Hey guys, Tony George, DocSports.com, Sunday update, free college basketball play coming your way. Matter of fact, I'll give you a lean to one we passed on early this afternoon in a late steamer tonight in the Pac-12. A good day yesterday in college basketball. Told you we were making a big run there. Four and two on a six play card to hit our five unit top play on Eastern Michigan. Um, did well. Gained some units back. That's what we wanted to do this weekend. Uh, picked up eight yesterday, so I'm going to pick up four more today in a Mo Valley best bet. Um, I got some great intel on this game today um, from my source in the Mo Valley. Uh, got uh, a text last night, had a phone call this morning. Um, local beat sports writer on this one, uh, who's uh, yeah, he's on my uh, um, Christmas list, put it that way. Nonetheless, we got a great play for you in the Mo Valley Day, a four-unit singled-out best bet. And in the NBA yesterday, I told you a big winner. This would have been a six- or seven-unit play. Um, we kept it at a four-unit play. San Antonio Spurs all over New Orleans who had injury issues. Uh, so you got an easy winner there. Today in the NBA, a first-half line play. Again, Again, only one first half line play loss this entire NBA season. Okay, right around 67, 68% our last 22 cards. Come on, get it done today. Singled out best bets, NBA college basketball. You will not be disappointed. Closing out the weekend strong here on Sunday. Let's get to, uh, and of course, the free plays yesterday, all one. The two leans we talked about, the old, the under and the Kansas and Kentucky game. Yeah, I thought Kentucky would get them too. I told you I really wanted Kentucky there. I just didn't like laying six. Uh, they won by 10, 10 or 12. Um, and it went way under. And of course, the over in the Evansville, Northern Iowa game shot way over the total. So I hope you picked those two up if you were listening to those leans. Yeah, probably not. My college hadn't been that hot, but. Nonetheless, Golden State late just by the hair of our chinny chin chin. That line shot up. So did the so did the San Antonio Spurs line, but, which reminds me of something quick to tell you. If you're betting the NBA and I have a play out and it's ready at eight thirty Pacific Standard Time in the morning or nine or I guess uh, ten Pacific, get on bet it right then and there. These NBA lines will swing three or four points, side and or total. Bet them early. Okay, that's the line we're handicapping them at. Couple games today of interest. My Vegas Sharp just threw one in after I already loaded up my plays today. Um, he kind of like Central Florida plus the uh, two today against Memphis. Just a lean. Official free play. Um, tonight, Oregon is taking on Washington State. This opened up at Oregon minus 14 and a half. Why? Have you seen Oregon play recently? I have. They've scored 55, 64, and 59 points in their last three games. You're laying 13. It dropped down to 13. Take it now. Washington State Cougars. Oregon 2-4 and four straight up their last six games, and they're 2-6-1 and one against the spread their last nine in the Pac-12 conference play. Come on. I know Washington State sucks on defense. They're dead last in the Pac-12. I understand that. But they're also scoring 71 points per game their last five. They're scoring 78 points per game on the season where Oregon's always scoring 71. I know Washington State's 0-5 on the road in true road games, and they were 0-5 in neutral court games. They're 0-10 straight up on the road. I don't expect Washington State to win here. But you're working with a lot of points with a team in Oregon that's struggling at home. Um, since they lost Bowl, you know, back in mid-December, they've just become a different team. You know, that was a guy that's a big presence in the middle for them, scoring a lot of points. But nonetheless, I'll go ahead and I'll take my chances tonight. Small play, free play, Washington State to cover the big number against Oregon, make it respectable. They got enough scoring where they can keep this. And I'm sure that Oregon will get a little bit healthy offensively against Washington State's defense, but I don't think they're in any way, shape, or form the type of team that's going to lay 13 points in a game in conference action right now. 
So we'll take Washington State as your official free play. Back at you on Monday. Come get some winners at Docs, man. Mo Valley, my specialty conference. Intel galore. Read the write-up. Cash the ticket. NBA first half line, one loss all season. Got one for you tonight. Pick that winner up too as well.